Hey. Hi. 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 Look what we've got here. It's summertime. <laughs> it's summertime. Yay. Can I first say we have never Googled ourselves? Because I think yeah. the internet's a wonderful, wonderful place, but it's also a super weird place. It's a and large, I'd like to stay out of that yeah, part. Yeah, it's of a it. large place because you can, you know, you can Google anything and it'll come up. Our really young, hip, cool, twenty-three-year-old niece who you've met before um, had this Hello, idea Bianca. that we should we should Google ourselves. Pintrolls, we do not know anything about this, do we? Nope. Our producer has concealed these like Oscar winners. We don't know what's in the envelope. Yes. So yeah, let's do it. How tall is Pinholders? How tall is Penn Holderness? Well, that's, so what, that's a common question that people have? Yeah. That's okay. I'm 6'4 if I didn't stretch. I'm 6'5 if I do stretch. Is the Holderness family Mormon? Is the Holderness family Mormon? You know what, that's, that's not a bad question. There are a ton of incredible creators who are of that faith and we yes. know a bunch of them. Yeah, they're lo lovely people. Yep. We are not Mormon. Nope. But no. But no. we do go to church. Sometimes? <laughs> Every Easter. <laughs> Don't out us like that. No, okay. So I'm we, going we go, we go more, we go more. Thank you. Kim Dean Holderness Inside Edition. Kim Dean Holderness Inside Edition. I worked at Inside Edition. Mm -hmm. I was a correspondent there for three seasons. So we lived in New York for like four years. I mostly did red carpet. So I got to interview J-Lo and George Clooney. That's the one. Super There's the one. You I, were like I, obviously uh, affected by it. Like oh my you gosh. Were, huh, what? <laughs> like giggling and flipping your hair around? I, it was got, awesome. I am not usually like starstruck, but he is somebody that I don't care if he was the yeah. person that was like coming to check to install cable in your house. Mm -hmm. I don't care who it is. If you met George Clooney, he has something special around him that I like my armpits are sweating just thinking about oh. it. But I started like I would say like like all like all the and time. You were doing that and with I was your like hair. twisting yeah. my hair and I was like, hey, like so like, do you like being like in front of the camera? It's, or like this is true. behind the camera? He's off. And then like he felt sorry for me and he answered it and then like kind of giggled and move on. So like, what are you doing here? And he was like, I don't know, what are you doing here? And you're like, ah! I did funny. not. Yeah. yeah, she did. How did the whole Holderness family start? This is a good one. How did the whole Holderness family start? Well, when, when a, a man, man loves a, a woman, woman very no. much. <laughs> We decided one Christmas instead of, I was too lazy to send Christmas cards and I couldn't get a great picture of my kids. So we decided instead of a Christmas card, we would send a Christmas like video greeting. And we thought like our family and friends would watch it. And then all of a sudden that was Christmas jammies, mm -hmm. which is like, has like a lot of views and people called us and yeah. Where did the Hornets family from? We live in Raleigh, North Carolina. That's the easiest answer. Uh, she was born in Florida. I was born here. In Raleigh. I was born in Durham. And Lola I was born in New York, York. City. Mm -hmm. Hey, does the Holderness family make money? Does, does the Holderness family make money? <laughs> Sometimes. I hope so. So honestly, we make enough money that this is our full-time job, which is fantastic. And uh, we're very, very lucky. And we know that that won't last forever. People ask us all the time, how do we make money? We get a small portion of the ads that run like before these videos. Mm -hmm. And we also work with, we're very picky about it, but we work with amazing brands and we partner on stuff. They pay us for stuff. We also, I should mention, are still uh, partners mm -hmm. at a video production company and digital marketing firm called Walk West in North uh, Raleigh, North Carolina, where we are behind the scenes and Penn produces amazing videos there as a director, including this one for Velcro that like turn it on YouTube. By the way, the person who's been Googling that is my dad. He still doesn't understand how, like he's like, he's good. can I borrow loan you some money? Yeah. You're just making them jammer videos and not really doing very much else with yourself, are you? How old is Pen Holderness? <laughs> how old okay, is nine. Pen Holderness? I'm nine. It's, it, <laughs> why do you think people are asking how old I am? Is it? He's 44. Mm-hmm, 44. I'm 27. You're not. Always 27. You're no, I think we're getting to that point now where I'm starting to look like I have like a trophy, like a younger trophy wife. Because I'm aging and she is not. And I'm it's, not sure how that's it's happening. It's my expensive icon. Yeah, I okay. can't, we'll talk about that later. What is the Holderness family net worth? What? We have a net in our front yard and it's worth about $3 and it goes it in our basketball broken. goal. Yep, that is our net worth. I actually don't know our net worth. I don't either. Why the Holderness family rehome? Why, um... Okay, okay, I know, buddy. So our sweet dog was not sweet to <coughs> people. All right, so Ruby, um... We did a lot of training. Yeah, R Ruby went through five trainers. Four trainers, bit five was people. Was it four? Yeah. This, Kim took this responsibility on while the rest of us were going about our regular lives. She took on the responsibility to find 
four people to try to help Ruby out. The last trainer, like the most professional one, actually said, Ruby's a sweet dog. She's just got to screw loose. And she said that several times. Yeah. The place where we got her from told us that we needed to find a different home where she wasn't picking up on various like types of anxiety where we have people who come in and out and work at this house or like the traditional thing would be to put her down and so we found a home where she could be safe because she was biting people here she wasn't safe and hey, buddy. yeah it was really tough on everybody uh obviously yes. you want to take a break bud yeah okay 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 oh, okay, okay. Careful, careful. we're okay but people ask that all the time and they make yeah. assumptions and we yes obviously it's still like an upsetting thing yeah i'm sorry baby no it's okay we, we've actually been a little bit forthcoming about all this stuff, particularly on our podcast. And uh, man, there are a lot of other people who have struggled with this, who, yeah. who just don't talk about it. She did everything she could. It was basically a full-time job trying to make this dog yeah. someone who could be like a safe part of our family and just couldn't happen. He's back. Yay! He's back. There's another how old is Penn Holderness? Oh! How old is me? How old is me? How old is Penn Charles Holderness? I am nine. You're nine. That was easy. Oh, how old is Lola? Twelve. Twelve. <laughs> Let's move on. Does the Holderness family homeschool? No. Super no. No. I really, really <laughs> admire homeschool, homeschool parents and homeschool families. Those homeschool kids, man, they go to college when they're like 16. Nothing but respect. Mm -hmm. We try to do homework as a family. No. Ooh. No. Yeah, uh, it's bad. Pen Charles, would you like to be homeschooled? No. That that would mean like you would basically have to sit at home without turning your TV on and listen to me tell you. Okay, no. <laughs> Is the Holderness family? <laughs> <laughs> we are real people. Is, Is the, the Holderness, Holderness family <laughs> real? <laughs> yes. Yeah, so, Wait, so what, what are they no, thinking? After, like, after Christmas Jamies came out, actually people thought that um, we were like a actors. cast. No, they thought it was, um, we were actors. We mentioned that we got a new car. Cause again, this was like a video newsletter and that was the biggest thing that had happened in our life was like, we got a new car. So they thought it was a Toyota Prius commercial so they thought we were actors. So I think what we're gonna do is show you some photos of Kim just after giving birth. I feel like that's the best way to explain uh, and show proof of birth. We are Holdernesses. Yes, we. They, they are our children. I am her husband for now. And, um, <laughs> And uh, George, call let's, me. Let, let's let's George. see if George calls and then maybe it'll be different. Okay. Kim Holderness College. Oh. I went to the University of Florida. Go Gators. I was a dazzler mm -hmm. on the dance team. Fun Great. fact, um, I, I've stayed in good contact with several of my girls and I was on the dance team with Erin uh, Andrews. She's a star now. Yeah, she's like dancing with the stars yeah. and sports things and says sports words. But she was tearing it up Can on the dance floor at our wedding. Her? Yep. Okay, what happened to the Holderness family? What? <laughs> what happened to the Holderness family? I don't think people, people saw Christmas jammies and then not everybody watches these videos. So obviously we were like, we disappeared yeah, from I the think, consciousness. I think what, what's happened is we've settled into a fan base that may not be everybody. Right. But, uh, but it's the people that we like. And the last one, drum roll. <laughs> brother that older his brother yes oh my brother dale he lives in raleigh as well he is the nicest person on the ever. planet yes we have a joke that if there were four of him at a four-way stop no one would ever move yes because he would just like no you go yeah. no you go no you. he's way nicer than you no offense and he sounds like this hey how you doing <laughs> dale he's like a big like accountant contro controller controller at a like a company in town yep but then dj's like weddings yep. and does karaoke nights at like clubs and stuff. Mm -hmm. oh, He's like fun. Batman. He is Batman. So yeah. it's like finance, Batman. super Batman. serious by day and then DJ at night. He's <laughs> DJ Dale, look him up, hire him. Thank you for joining us, for asking these questions on the internet. Yeah. Yeah, um, and maybe, I'm assuming all of those were my mom searching. Okay. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.